You can always talk about the two teams anytime they meet. There may be some sparkling moments of football as well. And so it's Kumasi Asante Kodoko and Accra Heart Folk. Hopefully today we will see a finish with the flourish. We train one of the Ghana Premier League and the fans have actually come in the Namas. It's the atmosphere which really is indicating most everyone is have become very much interesting. Anytime you're home and you're watching. You had the opportunity of seeing who definitely would have the bragging right. But as it comes to this particular moment, all you expect to see is quality football that will be displayed by the two clubs. All the fans want is victory for either side. Hearts of Folk have had some difficult moments at the beginning. They had to give up that easily. The ambience soaring, the temperature was at stadium. You know, the dice look like loaded against Kumasi Asante Toko. Coming into this game, they lost 4-1 against the Butuan Dwarves. House of Folk on a surge. You know, being in at home, beating Brickham Chelsea by a goal. You know, they're on top of the table. And that's a good enough uh, motivation and for Kotoko. It is the biggest football in Ghana. And you can't afford to miss it. Kumasi Asante Toko quickly would have to push things out front. And they really want to attack a crowd to folk so badly. But you can always expect to have Hearts of Folk replying quickly. They've heard some very fast players in Patrick Razak as well and Isaac Mensah, who really had to put a lot of the defenders of Marcia Santo Codoco in all sort of uh, pressure in the President's Cup. And quickly, it is Samudin Ibrahim trying to pick the round of uh, Patrick Razak. That's well to keep the ball in play. He's always quick on the ball. And uh, likes to run with it, but this time Atakusi doing his job well. You know, I hope Kotoko have got an antidote there. Atakusi closing him down, he shaded well in the present yeah. cup. You know, I, I hope and I feel that Kotoko might have adopted a game plan to stop his surging rounds and skillful displays. You know, Atakusi on the ball now, There's a bit of a um, stretch left arm there to, you know, de deny Razak. He's in the long balls just in the early stages and it's not working. And so you can always expect Kwame Boateng to go in there, the former Great Olympics player. He's really not played much for Kumasi Asante Kodoko no, since joining the club. Yeah, just returning from injury. The first shot that goes straight to goalkeeper, Enesoa. Uh, picked up four goals in his net in Cape Coast. There's Kwame Boateng now is able to beat up the challenge from Ruben Yan. Chan looking for support as well to find Nyami. Nyami again would have to bring the ball back. No, he should take care not to get himself into trouble. The first player to score here at the Babaya Stadium was Babaya himself. And since then, a lot of players have had the opportunity of scoring and hard to focus. You're also using the long balls and quickly he has to be pushed out for a throw in. You know, just analyze how Kotoko came under pressure. It was another needless surge and, you know, move there from the makeshift left back Samuel Chen. I, I raised questions about his play there, but that's all Kotoko can have. to four from Pong, picked up an injury and still not fit to start. Spreading play. You know, to beat him. That's a by Agbovi. No penalty, you know, for Hearts of Folk. Promising move there from Haas. Well, Hearts of Folk will have eight points as it's they're able to get a win. Somebody in Ibrahim. There's another wasted pass. No, oh, there he goes. A characteristic of um, Ibrahim. Oh. Very interesting story here. There from. Had to find a way 
to see if he can come back into the game and Robin Yan also working hard and back there for Accra Hearts of Oak there's a long Finish ball long ball looking for somebody and it is Stop it, and Thomas Abbey not convincing with that header Ruben Yan to mop it up for Accra Hearts of Oak is a throw in to Kumasi Asante Kotoko you know I've observed that Rwanda here that's um, to the 2017 Africa Cup of Nations. The Black Stars already have qualified. There's a World Cup qualifier starting in October. There's plenty of work to do. Escaping from the heart of folk play is Jane Fee. And there's a lot of space for Jane Fee. He's looking for Dauda Muhammad. And Dauda is able to pick the ball up again. And Kodoko can they score here? Yeah, wasting Nyako. Quickly, takes it up, 